Hi, I'm James Stuber, and I'm going to show you my workflow for bringing an ebook into my second brain. Here I've got my Kindle open with a book called What I Talk About When I Talk About Running. Now, typically, when I read a book, I'll go through and I'll read an entire section first, and then I'll start taking highlights using the highlighter tool. Here you can see I've already read this section, and I've got some highlights here. And in fact, I've actually read and highlighted this entire book. Once I'm done reading the entire book, I'll go into this tool called Readwise, which automatically imports the highlights from my Kindle. So if I search for running, I find my notes from this book by Haruki Murakami, and I can export these highlights as Markdown. Now what I do is I save the highlights into Evernote. And here I've copy and pasted them into Evernote and formatted the title a little bit. Now in Evernote is where I start doing more progressive summarization. So I'll go through and bold sections that I think are relevant or interesting, and I'll highlight things that are really important to me. Once I've gone through and bolded and highlighted things, if I think this book is really important, what I'd like to do is write the main ideas in my own words. What I do is up at the top here, I make a new section called Main Ideas, and I write them in my own words. Just to save time, I've already done that, and I'll just bring them in. So these four are the biggest ideas from this book that I've written in my own words. Now, some books may have only a few ideas like this. Um, some books may have way more, but this is just an example. The last step in fully bringing ideas from a book like this into my second brain is to start making connections. So I want to connect these main ideas to other ideas that I've had in the past or other things that I might want to read. Now, I use Evernote to store notes from literature so that if I ever need a quote, I can go through and pick them out. But for connecting ideas, I prefer to use a tool called Rome. In Rome, what I'll do is I'll make a separate page for this book, what I talk about when I talk about running, and I'll link the author, note that it's a book, and then also link to the Evernote note so that I can get back to it if I ever need a quote. Now what I'll do is I'll bring these main ideas in to my Rome. And I'll put it in the section called main ideas. Okay, so here are these four main ideas. Now I want to start connecting these to other pages in my Rome. So I'll go ahead and open this in the sidebar and I, I see that you know, keeping the flywheel going is essential for long-term progress. This reminds me of a term called grit, and it looks like I have a page on grit. And I see that there's nothing here yet, but what I'm going to do is start pulling in ideas about grit. So this keeping the flywheel going is one I wanted to connect to the concept of grit. So I'll copy the block reference and put it in here. So now when I'm researching grit later, I have a block reference to this book, what I talk about when I talk about running. And I can do similar things for the rest of these main ideas. So you can train yourself to endure almost anything. I think this is a standalone concept uh, that I might want to connect to other things later. So I can turn this into its own page by putting double brackets around it. Now I have a separate page about train yourself to endure almost anything. Um, and just from the top of my head, I might connect that to uh, a book called Man's Search for Meaning. And I might connect it to a few other ideas in my second brain. We can do similar things for the rest of these main ideas. Uh, let's see, understanding yourself is difficult but fruitful. Uh, this probably goes with something like introspection. Uh, and indeed, I have a page on introspection with some ideas already here. Now, if I ever want to write an article or tell someone about what I've used for introspection, I can look at this page and see the things that I've connected here. So again, I'll copy the block ref, and there I have this concept linked. So that's how I pull my notes from an ebook into Evernote, and eventually connect ideas in Rome.